Look, a missing kid. I don't like this. Maybe I should go back home. Besides, I didn't tell mommy I went outside. Bye. Don't go now, Miss Ford. What the I fuck? can protect you. Really? Yes. <laughs> All right, then. <laughs> yeah, sure. I'm going back home. Bye, dude. It was fun having an adventure with you. God damn it. <laughs> I'd do it. Wouldn't be that easy. Hello. Uh. Oh, wow. Freaky ghost girl. Ghost towns, everybody wearing masks and stuff. Ugh, smells like bullcrap. Misfortune, watch your language. <laughs> okay. Am I gonna talk about everybody wearing masks? A unicycle. Get it? <laughs> Very clever, Misfortune. <laughs> Thank you. So, basically, they took the whole damn bike and just left that wheel. Y'all some savages. <laughs> Phantasmagoria is coming to open fields? That's so awesome! Maybe we could find time to check it out later. Who knows? I mean, you just said we didn't Don't have time. With my feelings now. Let's focus on finding the eternal happiness first. Then we'll see. Alright, I can't wait. <laughs> oh, that guy looks creepy. Maybe we could him. find time to check it out later. Who knows? This what? just reminds me of like some Don't little nightmare stuff. Feeling. It's Benjamin from the hoods in the woods. Hide your child. You know, if you ever want to hang out or something, I'm available. Don't engage with that wild fox. I told you, foxes are dangerous. Let me handle this. Benji, are you a wild, dangerous fox? <laughs> Benji, don't go! Let that wild beast run off. I don't want anything bad happening to you. All right. I don't think I didn't spot your little name right here. The whole ad? Yeah, I saw it. Ah, oh, this is Benji's stuff. This is absolutely the best art I have ever seen. It's so personal. I didn't know Benjamin was so creative. Creative? That looks like a child has drawn it. What did you just say? Oh, I didn't mean it like that. Huh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Didn't want to catch these hands. Finding the prize. I'm focused. I am definitely focused. You got a big belly, sir. Are we going to the park? Yes. Okay. <laughs> so done, you fuck. <laughs> 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 I love this. <laughs> Mr. Voice? Yes, Miss Fortune? Has anyone reached the end of the game and gotten the eternal happiness? Yes, of course. Liar. Happily ever after. Damn. That sounds nice. You know, I want to win this prize for my mommy. I wish I could give her some happiness. My sparkle doesn't work with her. Oh. That's really sweet of you. Thank you. Would you like to try my sparkle? That's not necessary. Ha, don't be silly. Here you go. Happiness to Mr. Boys! Oh, well. Thank you. Anyway, <laughs> let's go find the prize and make Mummy proud. Yes. So, uh, yeah. Uh, for bird. <laughs> The end is near. What was that fucking like said, show the cat had in that? Uh, okay. Keep forgetting there was like some freaking show that kept yelling the end is near. I cannot remember it. That is a There's condom a and a dude. On the bench. That is There's a stick figure. Alright. Mm, interesting. What do you think? <clears throat> Miss Fortune, do you really need to read those poems? You know what? Fuck it. We're already halfway through it. Go. <laughs> yeah. Listen to this one. 
both hanging too low. No signature. Where are they <laughs> hanging from? Oh, look, a drawing of a cat. Come on, Miss Fortune. Let's go. All right. <laughs> Uh, it's bad because this Look is my type of humor. It looks like Kevin's dad. Who's that? He used to sit in the sunbox next to school. He didn't have any clothes on, and the police officer beat him with a stick. Classic. Well, damn. Remember that fish you picked up earlier? You mean Rodrigo, my fish friend forever? Yeah, my fish buddy. To the seagull. I'm sure it would appreciate some company. Hmm. I guess that maybe that will be. A fair thing to maybe do, I guess. Dude, uh, fuck him. He ain't getting my pet fish and he drunk. I'm keeping me fish. If you want a fish friend forever, you need to find your own. Rodrigo is my responsibility. Damn right. That's very mature of you, Miss Fortune. You don't get my fucking fish, bitch. Fuck you. Would you like to ride the royal halls of the park? I feel like you're leading me into a trap. I should say no, but I'm all about it. <laughs> royal horse, you say? I'm a little princess, you know. Look at me. I'm on the horse. I that is the weirdest stupid. fucking horse what? ever. I thought it was... Oh. <laughs> Unfortunately, I, I thought it was one of the spring ones, but you know, apparently not. Uh, are you worried because I'm such a little lady? Of course. You are really tiny and you could break. I broke my arm once. So you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. I wonder what happens if we do it again. Hell yeah, brother, let's go! Again. Cause and effect. Oh. Pretty sure if you probably do that more times than you you open up something else. Check out that duck. That's one gangster ass duck. Misfortune. Uh hell on. Get involved with ducks. <laughs> Don't be silly. You better not That's challenge my boy uh no, fucking Stony. This could be my opportunity to finally dance for real. Would you like to show me some of your dance moves? That sounds really weird. Nah, we're gonna dance a duck. Tell him what's up, bro. Nah, I haven't practiced for a while. <laughs> I leave it to the pros. Oh, cute. Cool dancing. Oh. Damn, bro, you just got served. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Okay, this duck wants these hands. I'm okay. That was unfortunate. What are you talking about? That was normal. Oh, if you say so. You know what? No, nah, these duck. This duck wants to get served. Let me serve him. Alright, fine. You win this round, duck. Would you like to write this one? It's like a tornado. You know, I should have learned my lesson from the royal horse, but fuck it. I'm all about it. I never learned. I want to ride. <laughs> that duck was all that duck was with those hands. Oh, no, oh, you're doing this on purpose. That's evil. <laughs> <laughs> oh, not a voodoo. When the trees are naked, when the wind is cold, when the smell of rotten apples smashes against the stone. Nani? Oh, okay, so when the leaves are gone from the cold air. When the trees are naked, okay. 
when the wind is cold, when the smell of rotten apples smashes against the stone. Okay, pretty straightforward. Mm, apple pie. What are you talking about, Miss Fortune? Nothing. That's kind of what I was thinking, a little bit of winner. This looks like the art of Benjamin, don't you think? I think it's garbage, and it should be erased with fire. Damn, bro. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> He's obviously very artistic. Just ignore it. Let's keep playing my game. The prize is closer than you Why think. Are you so pushy? Really? All right. Uh, I can almost feel the eternal happiness. Good. The last challenge awaits at the pet cemetery. You a know pet what? Cemetery? We that watched that movie. Like the best place and we all know how it ends. Exactly my thoughts. I'm glad you feel the same way. <laughs> Yeah, this is probably why, because the narrator is luring kids into her deaths. So, I was <laughs> thinking while we're walking, mind if I ask you a couple of questions? Yes. Sure. I'm pretty good at answering questions. I do mind. Great. Just answer as honestly as you can. All right. First question. Have you ever stolen anything? I'm just going to go with my self choices and yes. I stole my friend's Swiss army knife once. I felt so bad, I buried it in the yard and never told him. <laughs> oh, Savage. I'm so sorry for the both of you. <laughs> Second question. Are you happy right now? Are uh, you... yeah. Funny moments, bro. <laughs> yes. I mean, nothing bad is happening right now. That makes me happy. Well then, the last question. Do you feel loved? I'm wondering what would happen if I pick no, but I'm also leaning more towards yes. I'm curious about no, though. No, that's why I like my Stony so much. He's just a rock and doesn't get angry or sad. I wish I could be like that sometimes. Thank you for your honesty. You're welcome. <laughs> Look! We arrived at the <laughs> cemetery. Oh, no. Ah, oh, more missing kids. Another one added on to the list. Oh, shake this out. More kids are missing. If I go missing, how will I tell mommy? You won't go missing. We'll go back home right after we find the prize. Nah, uh, these are the okay, kids you lured nice. into the fucking trap, I know it. Ready to find the prize of eternal Hi, happiness. Bro. Yes, where is it? I have hidden it in one of the graves. I have to dig in a grave? Which one? I'll give you a hint. It's where the goldfish is buried. The goldfish, all right. Must I dig with my tiny hands? Yikes forever. No, use the shovel. What shovel? Money. This shovel. Okay, I know you're from hell now. I'm out of here. Ah, that shovel, okay. Alright, my guy from fucking hell, I'm out of here. <laughs> see that, see, when that happens, I gotta head out. Just some of the fucking shovel out of nowhere. God damn it, game, why don't you follow my logic? <laughs> <laughs> Man, just shovel, <laughs> just summoned a random ass fucking shovel this out of nowhere. Denise died surrounded by her loved ones in a fire. <laughs> Dude, I'm digging up all of them. Fuck it, we're doing it. But we're coming to criminal. Smells like hot dogs. I guess it's not the fish. We'll find something. Get out of here, bird. Okay. Let's see. Little Lulu, the first bug to ever strangle a man. <laughs> what? Okay, sure. Boop. Ah, uh, nothing. On the news, somebody 
and dig no fucking graves. <laughs> Stephanie Quinn, writer of the erotic novel Confessions of a Cat. Hmm. Wait, what? Erotic novel? Talk about crazy. <laughs> All right. No prize. How's the grave digging going, Miss Fortune? Good, I got this. <laughs> We're just digging them up, digging up all of them. Don't worry it about says, it. Paul died doing what he loved. It's simple. Yeah, yikes forever. <laughs> Take them all up. It's fine. Uh, no prize in here. Just a bunch of little bones. Yeah, we'll get it right sooner or later. Don't worry about it. Ah, uh, let's see. Roger the magpie. Never saw that window coming. Huh? I don't get it. <laughs> it feels bad, mate. Ah, uh, no prize in here. Ah, oh, this is the last one. We made it. it says, Mr. Bubbles. Hmm. Congratulations, Miss Fortune. You found the prize. <gasps> really? Yes. You see the little box? Open it. Oh, okay. Exciting. Is this the prize? But there's only a note. What? Yes, it says, I stole your eternal happiness. Signed, Benjamin. Ah, well. It didn't. My eternal happiness. I knew the fox was Nah, cool. I feel like this is trash, you liar. What a disappointment. I really wanted to surprise mommy with this. What should I do now? We must find the fox and get your happiness back. I'm sure he hasn't gone far away. Let's go find him. Yes, let's do that. Ah, oh, such a letdown. Ah, speaking Look, of which. There he is, Benjamin. Did you steal my eternal happiness? Not cool. Come on, Benjamin. Give me back my happiness. Run after him. We can't let the fox get away again. He stole your prize. Benjamin really disappointed me. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Quit on. <laughs> when unloved children in darkness search for what they have lost, for why they're in pain. Hmm? <laughs> God, they're yawning. Okay, when unloved children in the darkness search for what they lost. When unloved children Whoops, I was not trying to push that. search for what they have lost, for why they're in pain. Children in pain? <sighs> Did you find something, Miss Fortune? Nah, you're imagining things. Yeah, you're just imagining things, dude. Don't worry about it. We should keep our eyes open in case we see the fox. They know how to hide. All right. Oh, shake out this stone. It's different from regular stones, I'm telling you. I think you're right. The game of death is what beats the shadows of the beyond. Huh, what does this mean? That looks like nonsense to me, Miss Fortune. Yeah, uh, really? Uh. Maybe there's some more nonsense around. Yeah, I don't trust your fucking fool. Oh, I can save. Oh, I didn't know <laughs> I didn't know that. Aha, there. That hole looks very much like where the fox would hide the prize. You mean I should go down there? 
Yes, don't worry. Nothing bad will happen. Nothing bad at all. Okay. Mm -hmm. You sound very sure. I'll trust you. Yeah, you're so very sure that I'll, I'll definitely trust you. Don't go in here. <laughs> oh, this piece is loose. I'll take it for me. Maybe it works somewhere else. I'll put it back. Hmm. Nah, I feel like that's a trap. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave that. I'm going to leave it. Fuck all that noise. I wonder why Benjamin will steal my prize. Maybe he's not happy himself. Maybe. But I need that happiness myself and for mommy. Hello? Anybody down there? Woo! <laughs> Ah, uh, well. Oh, that was a pretty big fall. <laughs> Hello? Mr. Voice, are you there? No. Mr. Voice angry. Sweet, I found a needle in a haystack. Yeah, alright, so, uh, so we're going down to pun run. Right? Drop it. Uh. Ah, well, feels bad, mate. <laughs> Fox or pellet? No, we don't need no fox or pellet. It looks like there's somebody else behind us. Hello? It looks like there's somebody else behind us. Hello? Do we have to use the fox or pellet? Uh, well, I guess so. Fox or pellet? I can't deny the bottle sweet style. I'll take it. Oh, Bunny. Oh. Oh. Oh, there you are. What are you doing, buddy? Just what are you hole. doing, Benjamin? I'm curious. Now we're gonna say the what have I gotten myself into? She's such a mess. Maybe it was a mistake choosing her for this. I mean, I saw her eating glitter. Who <laughs> does that? <laughs> it's not natural. Uh. Misfortune. You're alive and well. That's great. Yeah. Where am I? What happened? The dangerous fox attacked you. Benjamin attacked me? So he really is a bad fox. See, I told you, that fox is evil. Yeah, maybe I should listen to you. We still need to find the fox and take back the uh, yeah. Maybe we could find out where Sounds like a whole bunch yes. of bullshit. Give me a minute to figure this out and I'll get back to you. Lies. Okay, I'll just hang around. It's all about humanity. Thank you.